Good morning. Sorry that I look like this. That's because I just came out of the shower, as has Aiden. We need to get a move on, so I'm going to keep this very, very quick because we are needing to leave in the next 10 15 minutes to catch a bus, to then catch a train, to then arrive in Durham to meet David and Ken. Two of our patrons, one is from York, one is from the States, and we're going to have a wonderful, wonderful day getting up to anything and everything in York. So it'll be really, really nice. But I could stand here and chat to you all day. However, then the vlog would be full of drama because I'd be, um, apologising for all the swearing because we've had to buy extra train tickets because we've missed our train. I'm going to dry my hair and get ready and let's go and have a wonderful day. So this morning we had a bit of a home alone moment because we were running around the house because we thought we were going to be late for the bus. Turns out we weren't at all and we got here like 40 minutes before the train actually arrived. <laughs> so we've had breakfast, we've sat outside and we're just having a nice calm time coming to New York <laughs> where normally we're running around. So that's great. Just waiting for the train now. Just waiting for the train now, yes. So the train was delayed by like 20 minutes and we said to David make us earlier because we were getting an earlier train but there was no point because it was delayed. <laughs> we literally should have just gotten the later one. <laughs> but never mind, we're going to go meet David now, we'll find him wherever he may be and then we're going to enjoy our dear in Durham, aren't we Ryan? Durham? F***ing hour in York. <laughs> So it's been lovely, we got to go to a nice coffee shop and David showed us this lovely place and Ryan showed you in the vlog as well and we got to talk about Harry Potter and philosophy and uh, the LGBT community, it was wonderful and we hope to do it again. Yeah. We've said come to Germany and we'll have dinner because it was so nice. But we also want to visit York again really now. Oh yeah, we're, definitely, yeah. I'll come, I'll come. We've been here two hours, we haven't even met up with Ken yet and we want to like, explore more than just a day. Live here? Yeah. Buy a house? <laughs> so what are we doing now? Uh, we're going to meet Ken. One of our long-time friends from uh, Indiana. Yes. And it's exciting, I can't wait. Yes. Right. All right. Let's go. So the food was absolutely delicious. Here's a picture of my duck. It was a lovely French restaurant. And Ken, do you enjoy our food? Absolutely. Wonderful. We're yeah. now getting a caricature of me and Aidan. That's obviously um, Donald Trump and Theresa May. Uh, Theresa May. We're going to turn into this. Yeah. <laughs> Reluctantly. And here they are waving, but they're trying to act. I wonder how much they're really enjoying this. I'm not sure that they are, but they're halfway through. I'll give you a little sneak preview right there. 
And as the artist is coming along, we're going to take a little over-the-shoulder view to see how he's coming as he colors in. Want to take a small look at the camera, sir? <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> the Americans are so blunt. <laughs> <laughs> so the question is, does Ryan really look like Donald Trump or not? Are you ready? That's really good, you know. I, I, I like really like that. You know. I, 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 I really do like that. Guys. You look like Danny Zuko. All right, now stand up behind it with the with the artist. There we go. So that they're up there just like that. And your name, sir? Neil Slater. Thank you, Neil, for your work. Um, if you haven't been to York already, this is called the Shambles. And basically, the two places are almost touching each other. We've had such a fab day, haven't we Ken, haven't we Ryan? Absolutely. Yes, it's been amazing. Absolutely. And now we're scaling the castle walls, well actually the city walls, yes. not the castle. And uh, we're going to an Italian and we're going to have dinner and then sadly it's time to say goodbye. Yes, and then we're going to have to go home and get ready for work tomorrow. tomorrow. It's been a fabulous four day weekend. We've had a beautiful French meal. Yes. We've had a look around the shambles. We've had a look at the York Minster. Yep. We've um, looked at the Roman column. We've had a lovely walk yes. and we're doing the city walls and then we're going to go for food and go home. Yes. It has been a, a lovely, lovely day. Lovely day. Yeah. Can have you enjoyed yourself? Absolutely. Brilliant. Yes. <laughs> so my intention was to take everyone to a place called Del Rio's for an Italian. I thought I was being really clever and good because it's supposed to be mint. And then we mm. just walked for about 15 minutes and it's closed on Mondays. So Well done Aiden. That's my fault. Okay, so the strangest thing has just happened. We left the train and got into Durham bus station and we bumped into our neighbour who had also been at York and also got the same train as us and then the bus. She was going on away on a, like an exciting day out. We were going out on an exciting day out. We have had an exciting day out. So the fact is that two neighbours who share a floor slash ceiling for her both went to york on the same day and traveled back on the same train and then the bus without knowing what even is that a small world yeah i just thought it was dead odd york as a whole was absolutely fantastic i am exhausted so forgive me if my face is like saying something else i had about i think it was like three four hours this night meeting dave this morning was fantastic meeting ken was absolutely lovely honestly 100 percent, it was completely worth it the day off the cafe financially no <laughs> but to not serve coffee for a day and instead walking around york yeah 100%. Before I do go to bed, can we really just appreciate how amazing the caricature, what's the word I'm looking for, drawing, is of me and Aiden? I think it's cracking. Have a look at it, like up close. Like he's even got me double chin in. Brilliant. Mm hmm. Like, I just think it, like he's, he's really caught me and Aiden there. I, I just think it's, I think it's really, really good. And it only took like 10 minutes. It's obviously like an amazing skill. I just think that's definitely, you can tell that's Aiden. And you can definitely tell that's me. I just think, obviously Aiden's a lot more thinner than I am, but he hasn't made me look too fat. But I just think, you can obviously tell that's supposed to be me. And now I just keep repeating myself. I'm just, I think it's really good. I really, really do. Oh. Um, Yes. Hello. We're now going to head to bed. 
Um, I've edited the majority of the vlog and I don't need to do it anymore. Now it's not a sensible idea that I stay up any longer because yes. we are back to work. That's you right. had a three day weekend, but I had a four day weekend because obviously on the Friday I was at the lucky because on the Friday I was at the funeral. No, not really lucky then. Okay, thank you very much. Um, I, yeah, to be honest, I forgot what happened on Friday. Yeah, um, it isn't actually that late, but we're just knackered, don't we? Yes, we can get to sleep very. Um, it's just been a it's just been a long day. Yeah, and of course, vlog talk is like hard work. It's hard work. Yeah, it's okay, but it's worth it. Yes, one hundred percent. So this week, basically, you're going to a film festival, maybe. Yeah, well, I hope so, but I'm finding it a bit of a nightmare to sort out my logistics. Yeah, trying to get myself to the airport at half seven in the yeah. morning. It's a bit of a nightmare. And basically, he's going to end up having to pay for a taxi to the airport that'll cost more than the flight, flight which is a, a bit of a pain in the ass. Then I can drive down to Cardiff for one, but it's like five hours. But then I can get the train, which takes absolutely years. It takes about four and a half hours to get a Bristol on the train. Oh, it's just a bit of a yeah. on. To be honest. Yeah. Well, just wait and see. You even said that you might not even go. Well, I kind of want to go. I'm yeah. Well, you, you, you want a film festival that his well, short actually, film is My short film in. was on the Thursday night was getting screened. I'm not even going to be there on Thursday. So I'm going just down to have an experience and just have fun. With the rest of the crew and, and stuff. And uh, the people who were involved in the film are going to be there. Yeah. And so I'd be nice to see them, you yeah. know. But who knows what's happening. Oh. I know. Um, but let's... let's Let's go to bed. Let's go to bed. Yes. If you have enjoyed this video, yes, give it a big thumbs up. If you haven't already, then click that subscribe button. And if you want to not be little, if you not da da, I'm so tired. Have you press that bell button so then you are notified whenever we upload. Yeah. Good night, guys. Good night.